our uh, college uh, 13 uh, teams participated for the smart india hackathon it is very happy moment for me and our team to join Think innovatively and this innovativeness will get transformed so that we are going to identify uh, students who having a skill in I'm uh, Dean School of Computer Science. I'm working here the, in this institution for the uh, past 21 years. Uh, I'm very proud to say that our, our students have cracked this uh, Smart India Hackathon. The Smart India Hackathon is conducted by Ministry of Communication and uh, MHRD. Uh, in our uh, college, uh, 13 uh, teams participated for the Smart India Hackathon. Uh, and all the out of the 13 teams, we have shortlisted 8 uh, uh, teams. Uh, and um, uh, one such team has uh, won the Smart India Hackathon. Uh, initially, um, uh, when the students participated, uh, they, like they, 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 they were very hesitant to participate but uh, through the motivation of the students and, uh, and the staff members uh, they have uh, uh, attended this uh, Smart India Hackathon. And college um, has got a very strong curriculum and uh, apart from the curriculum we train the students to develop their uh, skill sets um, through many job oriented courses and uh, through uh, through the MOUs which we have signed with uh, many other companies, we train the students to improve the skill sets. And this has given an edge uh, for the students to crack uh, this event. And um, uh, our college is, one, uh, is, one, is the only arts and science college uh, which has uh, cracked this uh, Smart India Hackathon. I'm very proud to say that. And in future, uh, more such teams will be participating in this event and uh, they will win uh, laurels to our college. Thank you. Myself represented a team for 5th edition of Hackathon 2022. The team was very, very enthused and young team that I have selected from our college. The only arts and science college participated from South India is our college. I am very proud of that. In this occasion, I like to mention a few person who stands behind our victory that is our secretary madam vasugi madam and dean sir sr madan sankar sir and dean madam of computer science dr maithili madam because of their encouragement their hope full for our students their way and their approach for their strength and we approach to the hackathon 2022 which is held at kanpur iit it is very happy moment for me and our team to join in Hackathon 2022 5th edition IIT Kanpur. Our students are very talented so that only we have open forum and we had a team of 10, a team size of 6 have practiced here and we selected a team that is the core team for this Hackathon is one team. We had 11 teams. Here we practiced and among this team, we have selected one team, that team is, the, the team name is Kaza Kanpur Red. And this was the team we approached to IIT Kanpur and the team was very uh, technically good and it was uh, technically good in hardware also. The team lead is Karthi Hayan, who was both technically as well as the hardware, he was very good. So I selected him as a team uh, head. And the person, those who are supported in the team, other uh, teammates are also very good in their each and every parts. One in designing and one in uh, developing an app and one in de de developing an embedded service and another in uh, supporting in their uh, softwares and another in their coding part. All, all such a thing was done. Uh, as together this is a team work, we have done successfully. At last, we have ended up with the uh, victory and we won the first prize in hackathon 2022 fifth edition with the cash price of one lakh when you when you ask about the uh, moment how we reached there and how we uh, finished this task it's very tough task and we had 39 teams each team of six per team and in in this 39 team and we lead a first thing is not an easy task we had 30 we have allotted 36 hours uh, job for doing this com for for completing this task our students have uh, day and night 36 hours we worked together and uh, the team worked together and the team had good cooperation and one uh, one of our teammates that is Karthi and team lead he leads the team with the, uh, with the 
modules of work and each and every students of a team had a module and you know that network is a uh, vast developing uh, area uh, nowadays and this uh, area only we chosen our problem domain and we found out the solution the using a different type of uh, tools that support our task and we completed it successfully and the judges have three round in that first round they ask about the task and what is the problem domain all that we explain the problem domain as a team and we we had a presentation too for the first round and we have done it successfully when you go for the second round they ask us to uh, show the demo live uh, what is your project and how the problem domain were defined even we showed that in live and they were satisfied with that and the third round they ask us to uh, project in public in front of all the teams and the judges was very happy and they asked that how you found out the solution and we have defined it and successfully we ended and at last we got the first place and once again and thank you uh, given me this opportunity to introduce our team and introduce our college uh, kongunoda arts and science college and this makes us proud and also our college was proud because of the uh, moral support given by our secretary madam dean sir and dean madam and our department staffs and their classmates also and thank you very much jai hind uh, at the outset uh, let me appreciate all these students who have won the hackathon at the national level this hackathon actually is uh, very pertinent in the current scenario one is because the amount of cyber crimes and the usage of cyber resources is increasing day and day even children at a very lower age they are being exposed to lot of uh, internets and materials on the social media so developing solutions for several issues and problems which are pertinent in this cyber uh, network and resource systems is a need of the hour the government as you know through the uh, ministry of education is doing this hackathon every year and the hackathon has got lot of teams and each of these teams i would believe that is actually addressing a solution which the government wants a solution from younger generation particularly students because when you know in another 20 years of time from now india will be the largest country with the youth population so it's the need of the hour and it's pertinent that the government is giving these opportunities for children so that students will come out with innovative ideas because because since they have been exposed to lot of internet and social media and things like that solution development will be very prominent from their side so and i'm sure that the team which have gone to iit kanpur from our institution they have developed a very innovative solution for a problem that was given by the ministry of education for the hackathon for the year 2022 and it is a fifth edition hackathon which i understand and i'm sure that such programs which are promoted by the government will certainly help the children of this age to think innovatively and this innovativeness will get transformed into a viable product and the product will generally be of use for two things one for the national security per se and secondly for several industries to take up this solution and develop them into a product which can have a global reach and i'm sure the hackathon will also help in our country becoming atmanirbhar which means self reliance where we can now supply or we can now provide solutions to the whole world so even when you look into the national education policy of 2020 which has been rolled out by the government lot of impetus and i mean uh, stress has been given for entrepreneurship and innovation these hackathons and uh, several such high kind hackathons which have been done by the ministry of education and also other even private bodies will serve as a a uh, fuel for the students to propel lot of ideas where india can become a very strong and secure nation in the years to come thank you first congratulation uh, to our kongunadu arts and science students who won a hackathon uh, just conducted in the new delhi uh, it is a great moment for us uh, last year we participated but this year we achieved this event uh, so after this hackathon event what we planned here is we are conducting a basical uh, scrutiny uh, for the first year and second year third year who joined in this institution and uh, the first year students we are plan to conduct a programming club through that we are going to identify a students who having a skill in uh, programming and who is having a knowledge in hackathon 
and we are going to train and uh, for the upcoming year uh, we send uh, more students to, uh, in a hackathon uh, to achieve more thank you